Hey guys, today we're gonna to teach you how to make the most awesome, gigantic bubbles you've ever seen. I'm gonna show you how to make the solution with easy ingredients that you probably already have around the house. And I'll teach you how to make the wands that you need to make these giant bubbles. Let's do this. All right, here's what you're gonna need. You're gonna need two dowel rods. We have four here because we're gonna make two different wands. You also need hook and eyelets. These are called screw eyes. You can get those at any hardware store. You need two washers for each wand for weights. And then you need 100% cotton rope. All right, first things first. Take your eyelets and screw them into the ends of your dowel rods. It's time to set up the rope. First step is to take your two washers and put them on the rope. And you wanna make sure that they're dead center, like this, okay? And then we'll tie a knot so that the washers stay in the middle. Just like that. Take your rod with the eyelet and feed your rope through. Give it about a foot. And then you're gonna tie that rope around the eyelet. You wanna leave some slack because we're trying to make like a, we're trying to make a connection on the top. And do the same thing with the other side. So our rods have two pieces of rope that we need to tie together. And we'll take those pieces and we'll tie them like this. Boom. When we're done, we'll have something that looks kinda like this. Now it's time to make the solution for the bubbles. I've got two separate containers because we're going to use two different formulas. In both formulas, we are going to need Dawn dish soap, cornstarch, baking powder. In this container, I am going to use the pure glycerin. And in this container, I am going to use the lubricating jelly. So we start with a half a cup of cornstarch half a cup of the Dawn dish soap. Get a tablespoon of the baking powder. In this container, we're gonna use a tablespoon of lubricating jelly. <laughs> In this container, we're gonna use a tablespoon of pure glycerin. And now you want to stir the mixture up, but you want to stir it very gently um, so you don't cause a bunch of bubbles in it. But you want to make sure you scrape the bottom good to get all the cornstarch mixed up. So we have to soak the rope in the solution for a minute to make sure everything's absorbed. And then we'll, uh, we'll see if it works out. So as you can tell guys, the bubbles are a huge success. What do you think was the better solution? I would have to say the lubricating jelly. Yeah, the lubricating jelly was definitely the better mix. Uh, even the glycerin we had to double and it still didn't match the consistency of the lubricating jelly. Yeah, so thumbs up this video if you guys liked it. The kids definitely did. That's all we got for you in this one. We'll see you next time.